everyone. So this video is a tag video and it is the MySpace questionnaire tag. Now I was tagged by the Easy DIY to do this one. And it's a series of 22 questions which were basically questions that used to float around MySpace on all those questionnaires. Um, and it's kind of like bits and pieces from all of them. Um, so yeah, let's get started. And question number one, are you a gullible person? No, not at all. Um, I'm not very gullible. Um, yeah, <laughs> you can't pull many things past me. But um, yeah, no, not not at all. Number two, are you left-handed or right-handed? I am right-handed. Number three, what are three items you will always find in your refrigerator? Definitely, you will always find cheese in my fridge, dog food, <laughs> and Vegemite. I keep my Vegemite in the fridge, so yeah, that'll always be in there. Um, question number four, what is your favourite planet? Ooh, that's a good one. Um, from the planets that we know of, <laughs> um, I guess I'd have to say Earth, only because it's kind of interesting compared to the others, um, and the other planets that I'm interested in aren't actually really planets, they're technically moons for the planets, um, but yeah, one of the many moons of Jupiter. It's kind of interesting to see all the discoveries that they're making um, about those, but yeah, um, I guess Earth. <laughs> uh, number five, who is the fourth person on your missed calls list? I actually only just picked up my phone today um, and it's empty, it's completely blank, completely wiped so I don't have a missed call list at the moment but it would probably have either have been my dad, my mum or my boyfriend. Um, so one of those would have been on there. <laughs> Number six, what is your favourite ringtone on your phone? I've got some of them I guess. This is the one for when um, my boyfriend calls me. That's um, Evanescence. I like this one as well, but it's really hard to hear. So that's the um, NCIS ringtone. So I think I just think that sounds cool. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have to pick one because again, I only just got that back today. So that's just whatever's on my memory card. Uh, number seven. If you could kiss anyone, who would it be? I mean, what kind of kiss are we talking about? Because that would really only be my boyfriend. Um, I think if I was actually going to... If I could kiss anybody, I would like to be able to have a moment with my granddad again if he was back <laughs> for whatever reason. Um, just so I could you know, give him a kiss on the cheek and thank him for everything that he helped me with. I think that is who I would want to kiss if I could kiss absolutely anybody. So, don't know if that's the way that it was intended, but that's my answer. Number eight, have you ever had detention? Um, when I was in high school, I did have detention once um, because somebody threw a piece of paper at me in class and I threw it back at them. And yeah, I got into trouble and I was on detention. So, yeah. Um, number nine, what is your favourite type of pizza? There's a couple that I like and they're actually really quite strange. Um, the first one is kind of like nachos on a pizza. So it's got ground beef, like Mexican style ground beef with the, um, those beans. I'm not sure what they are but they're purple. They're the nacho beans. Um, <laughs> then it's got, um, the nacho chips on it, the cheese, everything like the onion and you put sour cream on it and that tastes really good. Oh, another type of pizza is a pizza that's marinated chicken, it's like a Thai marinade chicken with broccoli, snow peas, cheese and onion and red capsicum and it's so good, um, it's, it's really 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 good. Um, but yeah, so it, it doesn't sound good, but it is. And snow peas, I love snow peas and snow peas on a pizza. 
awesome. Um, number 10, do you like super spicy foods? Um, since meeting my boyfriend, he gets really bad heartburn when he eats things that are too spicy. So I haven't been eating as much spicy food since meeting him. So now when I have spicy food, it kind of plays with my stomach and, and yeah, it's not that good. Um, so it's, I don't mind the taste of it. It's just that my body doesn't really appreciate it anymore. <laughs> Number 11, what was the last concert you went to? As far as I can remember, I think it was Evanescence, but that was back in 2006, that was, so that's quite a while ago. Number 12, what were you doing at midnight last night? <laughs> I actually know the answer to this one. I was editing and uploading my perfume collection videos, and I was doing that until about 3 o'clock in the morning, so I know exactly what I was doing at midnight last night. <laughs> um, number 13, what was your last text message? Or what did your last text message say? I don't have any messages on my phone at the moment. Um, but I think the last message that I got was on a spare phone. I think it was from my mum this morning saying we'll be there at around 10.30. Um, I think that's the gist of what it said. I don't have it anymore. Um, I got rid of that, so I don't know. Um, number 14, do you use a calendar? Yes, I do. I have dates written down on a little whiteboard. It's actually like a blue shiny metallic board on the side of the fridge. And I also have a calendar on my work computer, which has my budget and important dates and when the dogs are due to go to the vet and grooming and when bills are due and things like that. And then I use the calendar on my phone for reminders and everything like that. So a little over organized but yes I do use a calendar. Plus I have a desk calendar at work and I have a desk calendar next to my computer but I only have the one next to my computer because it's a puppy calendar and puppies are cute. So it makes me feel good. Um, number 15 what is a word you say a lot? Um. I say um way too much and it's not even technically a word. It really, really annoys me. I don't realise that I'm doing it until I watch my videos back and I'm editing them and I say um all the time and it drives me insane. It's a terrible habit. I almost did it then. <laughs> so, yeah. That's probably a word that I say way too much. Um, oh, I just did it. <laughs> but apart from that, and I say that all the time, that's another thing that I say. But apart from that, but apart from that, oh, if you have any suggestions about how I can break out of that or something I can put in its place, please let me know. Number 16, do you sing in the shower? Of course I sing in the shower. I love singing in the shower. It sounds so much better. The acoustics in the bathroom are great. No, it, I, I do sing in the shower. I, I can't help it. I sing almost everywhere, but in the shower, definitely. Number 17. What do you do when you can't fall asleep? I kind of just lay there. Try to relax. Try to stop thinking, which is, is hard for me. I, I can't really switch off. Um, number 18, who was your first crush? Ooh, interesting one. And um, this will really show you guys how old I am. When I was very, very young, I had a crush on David Bowie. David Bowie from The Labyrinth. For everybody that doesn't know what I'm talking about, Google it. Oh, and that's also where I learned how to do this. You know when he's going down, uh, she's going down the tunnel? And it's like, meep, 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 meep. and then there's another one that looks like that. Yeah, anyway, off track, but that's where I learned how to do that from that movie. Uh, number 19, do you play any instruments? Not really. I used to be able to play guitar alright. 
um, my brother and my dad play guitar and they're really good at it. And I play a little bit of piano, or like keyboard piano, but by no means professionally. Um, it's more just very basic tunes. And, uh, number 20, what was your worst injury ever? When I was in year four, so about 94, I was going down a rocky steep hill on my bike and I landed face first on a gravel road so all down my nose from here downwards and across there was all scabbed up and my thigh as well was all grazed and scabbed up so that was pretty bad and I think I actually broke my nose if you actually look at my nose from the side there's a bit of a bump that wasn't there before so if you kind of see I don't know if you can see it on camera but there's like a bump there and yeah so I think I broke my nose but yeah it was you know what can you do um apart from that when I was three I fell on the side of the bus and had to go to hospital like when I say I fell on the side of the bath, one leg one side, the other leg the other side, and I fell onto the bath. Very painful, and I still remember going to the hospital, and that's probably one of my earliest memories that I actually remember. Uh, number 21, what is your current desktop picture? I think it's sort of like a blackish teal with a girl standing in a doorway, kind of like the um, Evanescence, the open door CD cover, kind of looks like that, um, but it's it's not quite the same, like the open door there's a girl standing in it and there's a few ravens and it's very dark, but I like dark desktop backgrounds, um, it's just easier to see the little icons everywhere, so that's what it is at the moment but I do change it depending on what I feel like and the last question is number 22 what was the last song you listened to and the last song that I was listening to was from Florence and the Machine and it is Heavy in Your Arms and that's from one of the Twilight soundtracks and I think it's an awesome song I really like it but yeah so that's it that is the MySpace questionnaire. Um, I think for this one I'm going to tag a few people. I'll list them below. I'm not quite sure who I'm going to tag yet. But if I leave you off the list or if you're not on the list, I still tag everybody. So anyone who watches this video who makes their own videos, I'm more than happy for you to do this tag. and. I'm more than happy for you to video response it below. So you just go to the question box and then to the side of the question box there's a video response and you just select the video once it's uploaded. Um, and that's as easy as that. And yeah, so more than happy for you guys to do that. I think it's a, it's a different tag to the other tags that I've done. So yeah, there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you again really soon. Bye!